Welcome. My name is Daniel Deposa with Wardley Real Estate and Call DVP Real Estate. Today, we are taking a look at 5463 Sierra Brook Court in Las Vegas, Nevada, 89149. This is a $1.4 million property, just over 4,200 square feet with tons of very special amenities. We're gonna take a look at the whole thing. Let's go. If you enjoy videos like these and you haven't already yet, please subscribe to my channel, like this video, and tell me what your favorite feature of this amazing house is in the comments below. All right, as you first enter the home, right here off to the right of the entrance is a beautiful office. Spectacular built-in off to the side here. Uh, you also have a gas fireplace. These are some of the amenities you don't see in a typical kind of home. Lots of space. You could make it a dual purpose as well, or even a library, but as it's set up, it's gonna be a really nice office for someone. As we go the other direction, we have a formal dining room set up with a beautiful chandelier and also a lot of space with bay windows looking out to the front yard here. Now also right here at the entrance, we have double height ceilings with a spectacular chandelier and a wraparound staircase. We'll take a look at that in a little bit. Now that we've seen the first part of the home right here in the front, what we're gonna do is take a look at the primary suite right away, which is downstairs, which is a nice location, especially for a home like this. As we enter the primary suite or wing, if you will, you actually have a half bath here with a uh, standard vanity as well as a urinal, something you don't see in a lot of homes. Now, right past the entrance to the primary suite, we have also a closet right here in the corner with a massive three foot wide door. And then we have a custom bathroom. This is not a bathroom you typically see. You have a shower that has some things you don't see in a normal home, like some motorcycle handles right here, just in case you need to hold on while you're taking a shower. Obviously you have dual rain heads, you have a wand, uh, and also digital controls here for your temperature. That is some luxury right there. As we step out, we have a soaking tub that is situated right in the middle of these bay windows. They're also frosted, so you allow in some light, but nobody can see you as you're bathing. And then we have double vanity with a kind of makeup center in the middle. Now also with the other amenities and luxury parts of this home, the water closet even has a Toto bidet attachment to the toilet. So you have some luxury there and it's even automated. So there's electronic controls. Now just off of the primary bathroom here is this massive walk-in closet. Custom built-ins already here. So if you wanna be able to put your shoes, hang your clothes, slacks, suit jackets, what have you, there's a lot in here and a ton of space for that. And you don't have to spend the money on getting it customized because it's already here. Now, as we swing over to the actual bedroom, we have a very cool beam up top here. There's a lot of beam work that you see in this house. And then in the spacious primary suite, we do have a gas fireplace. We have double doors to the outside. And then we have this custom brick look wallpaper on the wall right here to give it a, a nice look and feel compared to just a standard plaster wall. Now, what we can do from here is actually take a look at the outside. As we enter outside, it is a huge yard with not only a pool, there's also a grass area and we have a custom dog run as well. Uh, what's cool about that is when you're entertaining, you have plenty of space for you and your guests. You have a hot tub spa right above the pool area as well. And you have not one, not two, but three fans in your covered patio as well as custom outdoor kitchen. Now, like I was stating, with this outdoor kitchen, this thing is made of cement, so it is solid. You have your barbecue grill built in, you have a sink actually, and you also have outdoor audio plumbed here as well. There are shades in the covered patio here, so you can actually pull the shades down and make this a very private space, as well as get rid of the sun. In the latter half of the day, you'd get a little bit of sun here, but not too much. Another very cool feature of this yard, not only do you have this massive grass area, you don't have the pool, the covered patio, the outdoor kitchen, you also have your own dog run. So a specific area for the dogs to head out, there's a doggy door right by the laundry and they can go right out and not have to make a mess in the rest of the backyard. Very cool extra thought that they put into this house. Now that's a feature you don't see every day. You could open up your living room to the outside through a custom 
garage door. Uh, if you wanted to, maybe you bring a large vehicle in here, uh, showcase one of your motorcycles, something like that. But this is actually the living room. So as we take a look in the rest of this living room, we do have a uh, gas fireplace that's custom on the wall there, a place for your entertainment and your television. And then right off of here is the beautiful kitchen. Uh, so we have waterfall countertops. This is a uh, quartz, so you have a nice look to it as well as low maintenance. Uh, beautiful upper cabinets. And as we get over to where the cooking area is, you have four burners with a griddle looking out onto your living room. So if you're entertaining, if you just wanna watch TV, it's right here and it's a downdraft system. So you don't have to worry about a vent hood or anything being in the way. Uh, double ovens, but they're actually side by side. So you don't have to worry about them being stacked on top of each other. And then you do have uh, one of the nicest KitchenAid uh, refrigerators that are available with the five door uh, French door. Another really nice detail you see in this home that's very custom is on the countertops, the quartz is actually slanted at an angle throughout the rest of the kitchen. So it gives it a little bit of a touch of luxury on top of already looking beautiful as is. You also have a Fisker and Paykel dual drawer dishwasher, so you don't have to do a full load every single time. Another thing that's just really nice, especially if you're entertaining, you just need to do some uh, glasses or flatware, things of that nature right there. So off of the huge kitchen here, we do see that there's kind of a butler's pantry passed through here to the dining room. So right off of the kitchen, there's actually another bedroom that could be used as a flex space for you or a guest room. There is a closet in there and then you do have a bathroom right off to the side that is a full bath with a shower. Uh, you have your connection to your gigantic garage space here. We're going to take a look at those in a little bit as well as another closet right off to the side. The laundry here is right off of the dog run that we were talking about. So you have washer and dryer, you do have a sink, as well as this is where your doggy door is for pretty much any size dog to go out to that dog run that we saw. And something you normally see in uh, older homes is you do have a ironing board built into the wall. So you don't have to worry about tucking it away anywhere. It's right here for you. So something that's kind of nice you don't normally see. So for the second floor, this is an entertainment space. Come take a look. Now in your typical home, you would have a standard loft. In a home like this, you have a custom loft space that does have a balcony that looks out onto the city and this one-way glass mirror. Uh, it's actually see-through as well as reflective. So it allows you to block, you know, obviously falling down the stairwell there, but also separate the space. So it makes it really nice and open and allows a lot of light into the room. You have a amazing half bath here right off to the side. We'll take a look at some of the custom features in there. There is a full bedroom with a full bathroom as well right off the side. So also guest space, or if somebody wants to live up here, this can be their entire floor and your primary suite and downstairs can be your side of the home. Now this is a custom media space. As we take a little bit of a step up here, look at how much space you have to entertain. Now with the TV on the wall right here, and we are on the second floor, if you wanted to do a surround sound, make this a custom theater room, anything like that, you have that ability. You have a lot of light coming in the windows here, but they do have shades that can come down. And you have space for a humongous couch, sectional, love sack, whatever you want to put here. Right off of this entertainment area is another bedroom. And this one has a nice feature as well with full bath, closet, and this also has the ability of stepping out onto its own private balcony. So the balcony here and the balcony on the other side are actually separated. So there's a lot of private spaces that you can have for your own or for your guests without interfering with each other. Now with a home like this, what else would you expect? Not one, not two, not three, but four garages. Now you have a custom RV garage and there's actually a back motorized gate access so you can bring in vehicles or whatever you need to from the back rather than having to come up the main driveway. Also can double as a workshop and you have access to the backyard through there as well as in through the house and the doggy area through the back of one of the garages as well. What's really nice about this house as well, only one owner since 1999, so it's been really well taken care of. And during the construction of this home, since it is luxury, it's two by six construction inside the walls, something you can't see, but just adds to the rigidity and the quality of the home overall. In the back where the covered patio is, there's actually a custom mister system as well. So in the summertime, it gets a little toasty here in Las Vegas, so you can turn on those misters. And if you're entertaining or just hanging out by the pool by yourself, you have the ability to cool down and not have to worry so much about the heat. 
I'd like to thank Kathleen Morrison, the listing agent for this home, for allowing me to shoot here. It's a magnificent home, ready for you to move in right away. Very little to do, tons of space. You have a lot of custom amenities inside. It's great for entertaining. Very quiet cul-de-sac here. You don't have to worry about a gate or guard gate or anything. It's a nice little cozy neighborhood. You have the back access to the RV garage as well as this huge motor court and four garages. Custom bathrooms inside. You have an entertainment space, a garage door inside your living room to really show off to your friends. That beautiful kitchen. There is so much to enjoy in a home like this. Once again, $1.4 million, just over 4,200 square feet, sitting on just about half an acre of land. Once again, thank you for watching. My name is Daniel Dopozo with Wardley Real Estate and Call DDP. I'll see you at the next house.